Hello the Pokemon Universe, this is the Vivian Wizard and welcome back to another video. And today in this video, we are once again playing Minecraft Communities, as we so often are. So today in this video, we are going to be carrying on building what we did yesterday, which is all the way back there. Um, and it is a bed shop. Well, not yesterday, uh, last week, sorry. Last video, I meant. Um, so, yeah, uh, we're going to carry on doing that. And I think, actually, I need to go and grab my dogs some more food, because I don't think they have any. So I might not be able to feed them today, so sorry, doggos. I'll try and feed you at some stage, but sadly, I can't right now. Um, so I'm just going to have some pumpkin pie, because I want to be able to sprint around. And so, yeah, we're going to run up here. Uh, we're going to... Uh, I think going this way around, just taking a shortcut around here would probably be the quickest way to go. And I never really go along this way. Uh, it's just a bit different, really. I think the only times that I've really gone through this way is when I was building this place, uh, the farm factory. But yeah, I think it's turning into quite a nice little town now. Um, so yeah, we want to carry on building here. So since the last video, um, I've found some black concrete. I've gone and filled in all of this. Uh, I've gone and added all these colours in down here. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I've also gotten some more materials that we're going to be need to, uh, needing to use today. So what we want to do is we want to... Um, I don't know, what do we want to do first? I think we might want to... Um, I don't know. I'm going to say... What we should do first is do the roof. Maybe. Maybe we should do the roof. The roof seems to be a pretty nice start. Uh, do I have any good pictures of the roof is the question. Uh, yes, I do, in fact. So I think what I'll do is... Um... Yeah, okay, I'll start with the roof then. So, uh, yeah, let's do this. So let's uh, quickly climb up here. I'm just gonna start with the Birch Framework then first because it's gonna, uh, well yeah, it's gonna have Birch Framework. That's why I said I'm gonna start with the Birch Framework. Um, so actually, I need to run back down here. I need a crafting table to make all these into half slabs. Um, so yeah, where's the half slabs then? So the half slabs should be somewhere around here. Well, I, well, this is where the half slabs are. Where the birch half slabs are is a whole different matter. Um, so I'm also going to make some of these. And I'm going to pile up here. So let me just make this into sort of a smaller staircase. I'm going to have to destroy that at some point, otherwise we won't be able to uh, do that properly. I won't be able to open that chest. Um, so let's do the front because the um, sides are pretty much just extensions of the front but going slightly further backwards. So this then goes along here, this then it goes along there, this then it goes along and up here. And essentially it's just going up by half a uh, step each time it goes up. Then this is the middle. So I'm going to uh, jump off here, and then I'm going to build up the same on this side, each time going up by half a step. I'm um, just going to go up like this. And then essentially what we need to do is we need to fill in the area uh, below this, because otherwise then there's just going to be a little bit of a gap there, and it's going to look really bad. So I'm just going to fill that in with uh, Birch half stabs as well. <laughs> um, so then I want to go up just like this for the middle so yeah this is still going to be the rough shape of it and uh, then we just I'm going to extend these back along here so essentially it's going to be each um, thing so it's going to be one here uh, so each one that uh, goes up on a half step thing, so this one and in between them um, they're gonna have like birch, uh, not birch, spruce logs on them 
Um, but on all the edges, so I'm going to have to build up like that, except, um, yeah, so actually what it might be worth doing is quickly, uh, I've mucked that up a little bit, haven't I? Um, it's quickly going like, not like that, going like here, going over there, and just placing that down quickly, then going up by half steps up here, one, uh, and then it's just essentially doing the same as what we did on the first side. Um, and then this bit I believe is the middle bit so it needs to be the same there Then I'll jump down and I'll replicate this on the other side and I might as well just grab uh, some of these uh, just to make it so I don't have to go and uh, change them over in the middle of building it just then it's a bit more convenient uh, for when I'm building up like hit, uh, like this here so let's just go and link these up and now I need to go and link up every two half slab things along this side. Um, so just going across the middle. Um, so let's just go and pile up along here. And well not pile up and I've just done that wrong even though I've just explained how I'm doing it. I'm not sure how I've done that but hey I have. And then the middle bit is going to be the bit um, like both of these middle bits are going to be filled in uh, just then it lines up a little bit uh, a little bit better and it's gonna like carry on being up so each um, half slab step goes up a half slab step in a way so it's gonna be the same like gradient but like it's gonna be different I, I know what I'm on about like you'll, you'll see in a minute so it's gonna be all these are gonna be half slabs then uh, these ones that I've been leaving as gaps, they're going to be uh, logs. So they're going to look like half stabs, but they're not actually going to be half stabs. So let me just show you in a minute. So do I have any logs on me? Uh, no, sadly I don't. But yes, yeah, so I'm going to like build up these along here. So it's going to be like half stabs, except they're going to be logs. I think what I'm saying makes sense. I might be wrong about that. But hey, um, but what we do need to do is we need to go along like this and just go in one, two, three, uh, four. We just need to essentially go along and fill these in uh, here just so then it doesn't look ugly from um, the outside. Um, and yeah, it should be pretty good. Uh, I do want to fill all these into the top though. Uh, just then it looks a bit nice from the inside so, so this bit is essentially just all about making it look nice but at the same time if we didn't want it to look nice then we wouldn't be building it in the first place so that was a noise um, and I was stuck up there so what we need is we need uh, let's more half steps so let's go and make them um, so I need to go and make a whole load more Birch regular blocks first. Uh, let's just go and make all of those into them and let's go upwards instead of downwards this time. Just save a little bit of time. And let's go and make absolutely loads and loads of these. So this should be more than enough. Uh, probably not now, but hey. Um, but let's just go and break away this just to uh, get up here a little bit easier. And then I'll need to go back down here to go and quickly finish this off. Wait, hang on. So that bit's done right then. Okay, so then it just needs to be like here. Um, and then here it just needs to be one, two. And I'll drop down and I'll quickly place this last two over there. So yeah, that's pretty much... Um, like the framework of it done in a way but what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do the floor so I came up with a relatively funky pattern for the floor um, or at least I think I have whether I can see it or not is a whole different thing um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and get in this chest here uh, I think this is oh have I got the wrong uh, this will do 
I was gonna use dark oak but this should do um, so what I need to do is so this block here needs to be um, like this and then I'm just gonna do a checkered pattern all the way along here we're just gonna do it with the spruce planks for now because what I'm gonna do with the um, birch is gonna be slightly different and it should look pretty cool I'm hoping so anyway um, so yeah we're just gonna wanna go and I didn't mean to break that one away I meant to break this one away this one away this one away this one away here and here is this right um, so now there should be no two grass blocks next to each other uh, except for diagonally um, so then this will all become spruce and then what we need to do is we need to drop down uh, let's just drop down from there for now then we need to go and get this dirt I need to go and do some fancy stuff so what we want to do is you want to so where does this start so we need to fill in one block underneath all of this there's a ground there I wonder what that noise was um, so let's just go and uh, build along uh, here just so then we've got like because I'm going to be using Berkshire logs which is why I have so many logs with me and hello and I thought I couldn't reach you but I was just missing sorry guy I know you weren't really hurting me but you're going to if I fell down and the likelihood is is I'm going to fall down so just had to account for some future mistakes there um, and let's just go and build along like this uh, just along here uh, so this bit here then should be the next well not deadline but this should be the next area I need to fill in and then I think you just need to fill in uh, all along here uh, so then I can go and put some birch logs facing upwards on there but for now I should be okay so let's go and do that and uh, carry on just quickly building over here and I'm gonna carry on there and finishing off over here so then all we need to do is we need to get up which is easier said than done because I've just blocked it all off and I've blocked it off doubly because I've just added another, another layer there so I think the easiest place to get up will be here uh, so let's just go and oh oh no I'm just hitting my head here there we go uh, so if we just go and place that there, then that should be everything fine here. <coughs> um, so yeah, this is all looking pretty good now. So I just need to destroy all these and then need to go and uh, place down these Berkshire logs on top of this, uh, on top of these dirt blocks that are embedded into the ground. And then I'm going to shave them using um, an axe and it's going to hopefully create a pretty snazzy pattern uh, I think it would look better if it was dark oak but sadly I think I chopped down the wrong or at least I bought the wrong things from the uh, storeroom with me so yeah that's a tad bit annoying uh, but we should have plenty of dark oak in the storeroom so I can always go and get that if need be and also I think I'll just break it up a little bit uh, just because um, like my path is like the dark oak and birch thing uh, except this one's a little bit different and I think this one it looks actually really quite nice uh, I think it's quite a nice pattern here so then I'm just gonna destroy these two um, hmm oh there we go that was perfect except not really because it nearly fell down but uh, then we just need to go like that and then we need to go and grab this and yeah that's pretty much uh, the entire thing so let's go and go and grab all these beds then so um, I need all of these I don't need red or black um, and I've run out of space but hey 
So I need lime green goes there, light grey goes there, dark grey goes there, white goes there. Uh, then you three can come up here and then I can place this there, this there, this there. And then I just need to go and grab this, uh, these three last ones uh, just from over here. Then I'll go and place them down uh, just like that. And then I need to go and place these signs. So essentially, the way that um, you do this is so uh, I'm not sure what I'll do is I'll put a screenshot on the screen now of what the symbol looks like. Um, and because it's not on my keyboard on my laptop, so like I don't even know what key it's supposed to be, like I don't know what it's for, but it's what you use to create colored signs in Minecraft. So I'm just gonna, uh, or yeah, um, I'll either put a link in the description or I'll put a screenshot on screen, um, of just showing you what it looks like. Um, so I've got a bunch of notes in my notepad that I've just gotten out. You might be able to hear me flipping through the pages of which ones are which. So sign colours, there we go. Um, so we need to put, um, so let's go with purple then. So we need to go, um, you can't see what I'm typing. But this symbol, um, so where's purple then? So, uh, five. So, five purple, purple, like so. And there we go, it is purple. Uh, it's a bit more of like a magenta -y color, but I think it. Uh, sort of works so it's just like a weird like dollar symbol sort of thing uh, I've, I've just put a screenshot uh, on screen uh, just so then it'll be slightly easier um, but then so what's this one so this one's pink so where's pink so pink is weird symbol uh, where is it uh, I think I'm using light purple for this then. So that one's D. Pink, maybe? I'm hoping this is right. So pink. Yeah, that one's right. Uh, and then yellow. So uh, actually, I think I'm using orange for this one just because the yellow one's really, really bright. Um, so uh, where is it then? So, gold, grey, dark grey, blue, green. I am using yellow then. Okay. So, yellow is E. So, yellow. Um, just like that. It's a little bit light. Uh, there's also a gold one, which I might end up replacing it with, but I can't entirely remember what that one looks like off the top of my head. Um... So then you just want to go like that. Um, so this one's green, but I need light green. Uh, or do I? No, I do need uh, regular green. So that is A. Uh, A green. Oh, no, not that. Done. There we go. And then you need a uh, light blue. So uh, this, and then it's either aqua or light blue. Actually, um, let's do blue. So that's nine. Uh, not that. Uh, Lick it. Blue. Uh, the thing is, though, is sometimes like you might not be able to fit everything in this sign, and that is a bit too dark, maybe. So I might end up replacing that, maybe. I don't know. Let's just see what the other ones are like. So this one, I think, is going to be aqua. 
So what which one's the aqua? Uh so B. Uh cyan uh just like so. Oh no, okay, so this one is what I'm gonna use for this one. So this one needs to be aqua. So that's B, isn't it? Um so here's the symbol, so yeah, so B uh light blue uh like so and then here is gonna be cyan so that one I'm gonna do as blue or maybe dark aqua so which one's dark aqua then so three um cyan uh there we go yeah that one's dark aqua uh, and then blue is just going to be this one and so blue is nine uh blue there we go and then this one's white um like that which one's white then so white is f so f white Um, and then light grey is um, so there's grey and dark grey so this is 7 then I think so 7 light grey how do you spell grey again it's with an A isn't it um, yep and then uh, like this and dark grey is 8 um, so let's just put grey for that except let's spell it right and yeah so these are like all the different sign colours I think it's really cool I don't know how long this has been in the game but I've only discovered it recently well not recently um, but like I've only really discovered it over these past couple of months so yeah I just found that really interesting and then as well there's one that I find really cool um, and I'm gonna quickly place down these doors and I'm missing a door but luckily I made like nine in the last video um, so we should have another spare one there so yeah let's just place that down um, but there's a another one which is what happens when you do that weird symbol and K and that is when it goes um, let's just type in hello so let's just put hello and then this happens uh, when you do that weird symbol and then K so yeah I've uh, found that really interesting uh, I found it really cool as well especially now they've added all the new signs and stuff um, so yeah just in case any of you are wondering how I did that then I thought this would be quite a fun way uh, to incorporate it into a build and then I could do it um, just with this thing as well. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. The next video will be online next week. Uh, as always, the link will be in the description once it is. And yeah, goodbye.